today we will add new disk in our asm disk group for example i have my disk group name data and it is of size 10 gb and there is approx 5 gb left and uh, right now i want to extend the disk group space so i need to add a new disk in this disk group so at first we need raw disk partition that will be provided by your storage team and uh, we can also check if we have root session so right screen is my root session so we can check here all the partitions so as per in my case i have got this partition it is new disk partition which i will use in my asm disk okay so at first we need to create this asm disk that will be our uh, asm disk which will be used in our asm disk group so we will first check our existing disks okay so right now we have disk 1 2 and 3 okay only three disks so i need to create another disk so that after that i can add this disk in my disk group so i will create new disk i will give its name disk 4 and this partition name completed again i will check okay now it is showing now uh, we need to check from our asm site whether it is available or not okay so now you can see i have one disk available to be provisioned so this is mandatory if it is not showing that means you cannot add that disk in your asm disk group now we will group name add disk we need to mention the disk path so this is the disk path we need to mention here then name uh, name would be i will give it disk 4 ok now you need to mention the rebalance power i will use 50 and uh, the max value is 100 so the more value you will use the it will take less time to rebalance but it will cost you a higher cpu load of server so you take decision based on your cpu load on your server if there is already high load on your server then possibly 20 to 30 number is quite good for you so i am using 50 ok ultra disk group disk group name add disk disk path then disk name and rebalance power ok so it is showing disk group altered but this size will not be immediately re reflected uh, in your disk group and uh, it will not immediately available for use in background oracle is using the rebalance operation and you can check that here you can see rebalance operation is running and estimated work is this and right now this is done you can refresh and you see it is progressing so first rebalance operation will be performed after that compact operation will be performed after that this space will be available to use to other resources rebalanced power 50 so that's why in my system is taking a lot of time since i have only two core cpu but in production server it, it will not take so much time
okay rebalance completed now compact step will be done okay it is completed now we will check again our disk status so you can see disk 4 has been added okay and you see the effect of rebalance operation earlier disk 1 was using around 4 GB now disk 4 is utilizing around 3 GB and 1 GB to disk 1 so uh, this is the rebalance operation done by oracle itself it, uh, it uh, decides to spread the blocks evenly on both disks so that IO will be smoother.